Hello and welcome back to another review with me, Overdose Vapes and Panda Vapes. Hi! What up? Uh, so, yeah, we're looking at some e-liquid. This one's coming from Stunna. Stunna! It's Stunna. It's uh, www, three of them, stunnaejuice.com, sent this out to us for review. This is from Birdman, the, uh, the rapper. The rapper. Yeah. Cash money, y'all. Cash money records, y'all. Um, so they've made some e-liquids. They've, they've got all kinds of stuff that they make. Uh, rolling papers, vodka, music, and now e-liquid. And yeah. so, um, yeah, they sent it out for us to review. Uh, to her and to me separately. So we thought we'd just do it together. Thank you. Yeah, and so, you know, the only weird thing is that she got black bottles and I got clear bottles. Yeah, my bottles are cool. What's up with that? I prefer black bottles, so. I like black bottles. But speaking of the bottles, let me go close real quick, get it out of the way, and just look at the bottles. We're back. So, We're back. what do you want to start with? The, so there's the, two different flavors. Let's, let's start oh, off with the, this one. Don't mind the cats. Yeah, they, they don't like each other. Um, uh, there, it's a love-hate kind of thing. We're back. Okay, so there's two e-liquids. Yeah. Yeah, she got the black bottles. I don't know what the difference is. But, um, yeah, I don't know why she got black bottles. I got clear bottles. Mm. Makes me a little mad. Your bottom's different, too. It is different, yeah. Look, I got, like, some You got the kind. Gorilla logo. That's from the Gorilla bottles. I got it straight from the source. <laughs> I think mine were just some early versions or something because, yeah. He got them a long time ago, and, um, who was that? I, I keep forgetting their name. Vapecraft. Vapecraft sent, uh, contacted me later on. Like, he got it a long time ago. It was like... It's been a while. Yeah. It's been about a and, month. And, um, they must have decided to change the bottles to black. Yeah, they look, yeah, they're a little different. And, yeah. I mean, maybe it does look better with black. It so does. They and, black, and black will keep sun out from damaging the nicotine and stuff, mm -hmm. so it's always better to have dark colored bottles. And this is manufactured by Vapecraft. You guys might know them. I've done reviews. I think Pan has also done reviews of Vapecraft e-liquids oh, yeah. in the past. But, um, That's why but it's contacted me. <laughs> exactly. But it's in partnership with Birdman and Cash Money Records and StunnaEjuice.com. So you can find it at StunnaEjuice.com. We'll These leave flavors below. are like, you can tell they drink. Just <laughs> flavors. Uh, well, one of them has bourbon in it, so. I mean, they're like flavors that you would definitely be able to taste with alcohol. Because if you, if you drink and you vape, you, you would know that, like, sometimes drinking mutes out your vape flavor. If you, a lot of flavors can get muted out by um, drinking. So these ones, I would think. They're because potent. The, just by the... I, just by the sound of them, they sound like they would go through. There's some heavy duty flavors. Yeah. Yeah. I can just smell them. I can smell the, the one, definitely. So there's two different flavors. There's Cash Money, and it's, I'll just tell you what it says on the card here. It's a full experience of bold bourbon, creamy sweet notes of vanilla, brown sugar, and custard finished off with a light cheesecake on the exhale. That sounds good. That sounds really good. That cheesecake won me over. I see now, I was like, what? Just a lot of, it's a lot of really decadent, creamy kind of stuff going on there, which is always good for me. That's like definitely right up my alley. The bourbon's the one thing, it says bold bourbon, so that's like the one thing that makes me feel a little bit hesitant about it because bourbon is just like a very strong flavor, so we'll see. We, we made something else with bourbon and I know I didn't like it. Yeah. I was like, mm. it's like, it's a real specific flavor, and so either you like bourbon or you don't, and so... Uh, I'm not a big bourbon guy, but we'll see how it plays out here because there's a lot of other stuff there. The liquid gold is the ultimate sweet sensation. A blend of ripe pears, candy, watermelon, mango, and apricot make make for a refreshing flavor that you can vape all day long. There's definitely some interesting flavors. It's not boring. At, apricot by any turns means. me off automatically. <laughs> <laughs> and it's very strong on the on the the aroma. And Both of these have I very strong the aromas. apricot um, e-liquid. I did not like it. Um, it's like me vaping pineapple. I never like it. It's something about it. It just does not go well with me. I'm vaping liquid gold right now. If you see me vaping, I'm vaping the liquid gold. Yeah, I've actually tried the cash money already. So, you want to start with cash money? Mm -hmm. Since it's the first one on the card? Okay. Starting with cash money, let's go ahead and get it. I got mine on the, um, what the hell's the name of this? Oh my god. I forget the name is RDA. I need to know it now. It's going to freak me out. This is the uh, Venus from Stage Vape. 
It's a really great RDA if you guys haven't tried it already. And I got the um the Petri. Yeah, Petri. Petri from Dot Mod. And the Trinity caps with the Dreamer. And this is the US I one. I stay mod. with Trinity caps all the time. <laughs> all my RDAs have Trinity caps on them. It's nice definitely and a smoke. Yeah, it's definitely cloudy, which I love. You know, yeah. I love them clouds. It's a nice thick clouds. 70 30, 70 VG. Wow, I would think it would be 80 20. Yeah, it vapes, it vapes higher than what it actually is. Yeah, yeah it vapes like 80 20. Yeah, it's really good. It's actually really, really good. So um, I get, you definitely get brown sugar, vanilla, custard. That bourbon is very light. Very, very light. Like it's barely even there. It's more of but a back, more of a like a you aftertaste. Taste, I taste it yeah. like, on my tongue, but it's not unpleasant whatsoever. Like I can definitely t vape this all day long. Like yep. it, I think it is going to be my new all day vape. Definitely. It's, it's more of an aftertaste. The bourbon part of it is for me. I get more of it like left and it over. Like, but it like goes well with. The, like I don't really taste the cheesecake that much. No. But I think it, it blends with the cheesecake, so it makes it a it makes it pleasant like a pleasant bourbon flavor. Like a cooked down bourbon yeah. in in a dessert kind of setting. Yeah. So it's making it pleasant. It's not making it like ugh. Because I've had a nasty bourbon. Me too, Rose. <laughs> it's that this it tastes like it has the alcohol boiled out of it. Like if you're cooking, you're cooking with alcohol. With it. And you, you boil it down so it doesn't actually get people drunk when they're eating it. That's what this tastes like. Yeah. You're kind of left with some notes it's that really are... It's really good. Really kind of like... like a, it's a little dry. It's a little dry, yeah. It's a dry um, vape, but yeah. it's, a, it's it's really good. I didn't think it was going to be good. Because even... I was excited about the cheesecake part of it, but the bourbon just kind of scared me. <laughs> it's a very soft flavor. It's not like real in your face or anything. It doesn't like... Hit you like, too I definitely hard. slept on it because I had it's just sitting here. I, it's been in the package, just waiting for me to um, review it. And I, I saw the bourbon. I was not very excited about it. I saw the other flavor, not very excited about it. So I just like slept on it and just put it aside. And but I should have been. I've been looking for something new to vape on, and definitely should have been vaping that because it's good. <laughs> it's a really interesting take on vanilla custard. Like to me, it tastes like a vanilla custard with bourbon. Mm -hmm. And it's really, really yeah, you don't interesting get the take cheesecake on it. At all. No, I don't get the cheesecake. But you it kind of a little bit of texture of the cheesecake. And it adds a little bit to like the overall creaminess of it. It's a really creamy vape. It's dry, like she said, but there is like a real creaminess element. Creaminess. It's like a creamy element. custard. Yeah. It's a definitely a creamy custard. Yeah. And definitely. you get that vanilla in there. Yeah. And brown sugar. It's a, yeah. It's like it's, yeah, it's, it's like it's a mixture of everything. It's like flan. I don't know if you guys have ever had flan. Oh, yes, it is. It's, it really tastes like flan. It definitely does. Yeah, with some bourbon on Like bourbon cooked into the sauce. Yeah. It's, it's what, exactly what it tastes like to me. I haven't had that in a while. And as soon as you said that, I can definitely taste flan. Yep. Oh, now I want some flan. Me too. I love flan. <laughs> yeah, to me, it's a really good flan flavor. It's not it's not how they advertise it, but that's exactly what it tastes like. And mm -hmm. I think it's... They should have advertised yeah, it like it's that. it's really damn good. It's really damn good. So, um... I would give it probably a four out of five. I think it's really, really good. Give it thumbs up. Is it double thumbs? Double thumbs. I'll be definitely vaping it. Is and this something I would vape for it's sure? Not, it's so out of my element, but I've been looking for something different, and this is definitely something that I could vape. In. Yeah. Is this something that I would never pick up on based, your own. based on the profile alone, but I'm so glad we got a chance to try it because this is something I'll definitely vape. 100%. Definitely can't like always go by flavor profiles because everyone tastes things differently. And they might have thought, thought like, I don't know, maybe they taste the bourbon because they drink bourbon. I, I don't drink bourbon, so I just don't get it. This probably goes really well with bourbon, to yeah. tell you the truth. Like, I don't know, if you've ever had bourbon, it's, it's got a really unique flavor to it, and it would go really well with this. It would. I think so. I think both their e-liquids were made around drinking because I'm sure they drink all the time because <laughs> they're, they're rich. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's, let's try a liquid gold. And this is a refresh. This is a ripe pear, candy watermelon, mango, and apricot flavor. I'm not excited about this one at all. So I actually, before we even start, I actually really enjoy this. I think it's really good. I enjoy the smell of it. The smell smells really good. I but. get more and more candy watermelon as we go with it too. Like when I first tried it, it was definitely apricot. 
Boom. It's actually not bad. I get a lot of the candy watermelon, which yeah, is saving it. Because if I got more of an apricot, it would have been a no-go for me. But I'm getting that candy watermelon, and I like candy watermelon. So it's definitely more, uh, I'm not getting mango that much. I get some. Maybe a little bit. A little mango. But pear, I'm not, pears, I'm, I get what, no what pear. What does pears taste like? Like, honestly. <laughs> like, pears don't really have a flavor. I can think of it in my Actually, mind what I a pear had a tastes pear like. drink last night. Yeah. So, yeah. I can think but of what a pear tastes like, but this, taste is, like this, this doesn't taste the like The candy, pear. watermelon, and the mango is the more flavors. I The apricot is like, the sm you smell an apricot. Big time. It's a big part of I the thought, aroma of it. But after you get past it, you start tasting more of the candy, watermelon, and the uh, mango. That's what the the main component, like the dominant components are. To me, it tastes like uh, watermelon Sour Patch Kids a little bit. Like a gummy kind of sugary... Watermelon it's definitely candy. a candy yeah. bait. That that um candy watermelon is like making it a candy bait definitely. more than a. Um, I thought it was gonna be like a fruit fruity, yeah. but the the watermelon definitely stands out. Big it's time. so funny because when I first started vaping it, it was definitely it was different. apricot mango I hate it. fruit. I, the Boom. first thing I did was yuck, <laughs> and then I don't know. I vaped it a few other times, and then that. Other flavors started coming through yep. once it started settling in the cotton, and the um, the candy, watermelon, and the mango just started coming out, and it's, it's actually is good. It is really good, yeah. I really like. I think the watermelon and the mango are such a good combination because watermelon is like a really light, watery kind of flavor. That takes a little bit of apricot. Yeah. But it's very little. It's very, very calm, light, yeah. so it's not like. Because the apricot can ruin a vape. If it's, it's really too strong. strong. Yeah, it's really strong flavor. And I like apricot normally. Like, I can eat apricot. But for some reason, in a vape, it doesn't work for me. Yeah. Um, but it the, the candy, watermelon, and the mango saving this e liquid. Absolutely. You know, it's so weird because, like, you guys know me. I am not a fan of menthol liquids. And this one doesn't have menthol in it. But actually, I think it would be okay. With menthol, in it. like a little bit, a little bit of like coolant in this might be good. Um, I mean, they might maybe that's something they can uh, explore in the future. Um, to me, I don't even know where yeah, it's coming I mean, from, but it like, seems like it's, it does seem like it's missing it. Yeah, like it should have. Like it, it should it. have it, but like it's just a small smidge. Yeah, not too much. Don't like. Because people can go wrong a lot yeah. of times and they put too much and then it just ruins it. But I think just a little bit, just to make it refreshing feeling, yeah. I think it would, it would work. It would brighten it up a little bit, I think. Yeah. And it's not that it's saying it's bad at it all. It just That's feels really like, like it's it. missing just a, something. Yep. Yeah, it's, it's de I definitely don't like liquid gold as much as I like cash money, but yeah. they're so different. So. Yeah, they're so they're definitely two different e liquids all around. But I enjoy, actually enjoy both of them. It's so weird because I, I didn't I think didn't I was going to enjoy. I didn't think I was. We actually yeah. thought we were going to have a giveaway, and I, we were like, if we don't like them, we're having a giveaway. But yeah, I, nope. we're keeping them. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, they're good. They're really good. I'm so surprised. I really, really am. Uh, you, you know, I just didn't expect... It's kind of like a tie-in with, like, an artist. You just don't... I, I don't know. For me, personally, I just... I, I didn't expect a whole lot. But, you know what? They did a really, really good job. Yeah. Vapecraft did a good job here. Uh, Birdman, the guys over at Stunny Liquid, they did a great job. So, uh, I look forward to what they provide in the future. This is, like, obviously the first two liquids I that love they're making. Their, so. their, I love their marketings. I, you know me. I'm all about, like... I have to talk about the marketing. And I just love it because the cash money is so pretty and it's like blingy and all that. It's definitely cash money. And then the liquid gold, it's, it's all got dripping, dripping the liquid gold. Like, obviously, you've seen in the up close. It, they did a perfect job with yep. both the names and they made it match. And, and it's. It's awesome that they didn't make it like just the bottles the same. They yeah. they made it different to go with the names, and I like that they put actual thought into it. And it's like so well done. It's it, it just looks nice. It doesn't look tacky. It's, no, it's it's simple yeah. but classy, and it's unique. It's definitely it's, adult oriented. It doesn't yeah. look like it's for kids. It looks no, like it's it, for adults. It, it looks like it's like liquor, like a liquor. It'd be a liquor bottle. Totally. Now that you say that, yeah, actually, it really does. Yeah. yeah. Like it would be on something that they would create it in a liquor bottle. I like it a lot. 
Yeah. And for you know, and for the liquid gold, I'll give it also a four out of five. I think it's really, really good for what it is. I think that um, if you're if you're into candy or fruit, either one, I think you're gonna enjoy this. It's it's really. really so. Yeah, I mean, or on the candy side though, because yeah. it does that. That I mean, candy that watermelon, watermelon comes out real just strong. Comes yeah. out. Yeah. I mean, not at, at first you might not. I, I honestly was like, yuck, at my first two vapes. But then I don't know. So it just settled in that cotton, and it the flavor changed on you, and that candy watermelon just stuck out a lot more, and it made it more pleasure, way more pleasurable vape. It comes out more and more the more you vape. Yeah. It's so weird. It's so weird. Yeah, it came alive for me. I really enjoyed it. Boom. I think you can't go wrong with either one of these liquids. It's got something, I think, for, for I everybody. I was not expecting this to have a good... No. Like, I thought one of them was going to be a no-go. I was not expecting us to like both of them. I thought at the very least, like, one of us would dislike one I of them. Swear, like, because he was like, he liked the, um, the liquid gold. And I was, I was like, no, I don't like it. And then I started vaping a little more, and I do. It's crazy. Pretty unusual. Yeah. Pretty Especially unusual for both of us. we both have different yeah. flavor profiles, and it's definitely, like, something it, I can vape all day. And this is, like, one of those times... Especially like, in summer, liquid gold yeah. would be a very good summer vape. Definitely. Outside, when yeah. you're out drinking, or, or even at the, at the beach, or sitting out front, and just hanging out. It's definitely a refreshing... Um, Vape. It is. I yeah. think I like candy vapes because for summertime, they're yeah. re really refreshing. And it's light. Especially watermelon. Watermelon's yeah. so good outside. Like, out, even if you're not drinking, just I I did um I baked a, a couple of, um watermelons, vape vapes, and it just tastes really good in the heat for yep. some reason. They're just really it's refreshing. refreshing. They're yeah. refreshing. Yeah. And this would be good like, eating watermelon at a at a barbecue or a picnic. Having mm -hmm. some watermelon, vaping some liquid gold, I can see that working really well. Yeah. So it's like twenty two ninety nine from their website, from stunnyeliquid.com, uh, stunnyejuice.com, and we'll, like I said, we'll leave links below. And Panda did find it cheaper at. Uh, um, eJuice Connect got it for thirteen ninety nine. <clears throat> um, I always would, I I always tell you to go to the source though because sometimes you don't know what you're getting with these cheaper um, prices. Like why is it cheaper? You don't know. Or I don't know if that's a wholesale price also because yeah, yeah. it could be a wholesale because I don't. And these are the guys who sent it to us. So we'll leave links below for these guys. Does it did say it did say like wholesale on the mm, website. Yeah. Yeah, wholesale to the oh to no, the to public. public yeah. So it's thirteen ninety nine at Eju's Connect, but I mean it's worth it's it's worth the what they're asking for. Twenty two ninety nine. It's it's not for one hundred twenty mils. You can't beat that. No, and especially premium e liquid. Which this definitely is. Yeah. And you can get it from their site. You can also get it. I mean, all the we saw like when we looked, all the big companies have it. Like all the big websites have it. Like Vapor DNA, different places. You did. Yeah. So wherever you're comfortable but buying yeah, but from. Yeah, Vapor DNA was selling it was for more. more. It was more expensive. So. Yeah. So. I don't, I don't know, know why you would buy it from them, but... I don't know why they would even charge it yeah. for more than the, the people that made it. But, I mean, wherever you're comfortable buying from, this is going to be available. So, um, i definitely recommend it. Yeah, me too. All right. So, thank you so much to stunnetejuice.com for sending this out to That's us. Easy really review. appreciate it. It was very easy. <laughs> no arguments here. It's just good. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, we really appreciate you guys watching. Yeah. And, and I appreciate... They sent it out to us. Always. I like when they send us juice. Now we don't have to fight over it. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I like that they contacted us, Pope, instead of just because they, they know that we, we reviewed together and stuff, but we don't like to share. No, so. we don't. <laughs> okay, thank you guys so much, <laughs> and we'll see you next time. Please keep close tight. Bye. Peace. Do they look saggy? No, they look saggy. They look fucking delicious. Like ripe melons. You can't see your banana socks, I don't know you're a dork. <laughs> I'll show <clears throat> my banana socks. Banana sock rocks.